Righto. Well, today we've got a video talking about a new update to a PinePhone operating system. Now, a while ago we talked about Ubuntu Touch on the PinePhone, and one of the things that didn't work very well is the camera. Well, recently there's been an update to Ubuntu Touch for the PinePhone, which actually adds hardware acceleration for the camera. Now, right here we're running the current development build of Ubuntu Touch. I'm sure eventually it'll make its way into other channels, but for now I believe it is only in the development version. So what we're going to go ahead and do is open up the camera app and I'll show you how well it now works. So it takes a second to warm up, but eventually, as you might be able to see, the camera now works. And it's not the smoothest thing in the world, as you can see. However, it's not bad at all. The front facing camera also works from what I can tell, and like I say, it's hardware accelerated. It's not as smooth as perhaps some other cameras are, and certainly it's not as smooth as megapixels on other operating systems for the PinePhone. But it's not bad, it's not bad at all. Now, let's go ahead and take a picture, which is something that we could do before, but now you can see it was quite fast. So then let's go ahead and go into the gallery and take a look at our picture. Now, as with the last time that we looked at this, the gallery previews do not actually work. But once you tap on it, well, Sure enough, there's our picture, and it worked pretty well. So I'm now going to say that on Ubuntu Touch, on the Pine phone, you can now take photos, and it works pretty well, and I think for most people that's going to be absolutely fine. So now, on Ubuntu Touch, there's only really a handful of things that don't work. It's still not daily driver ready, but it won't be long until it is. Now, I'm sure something that a lot of people are wondering, and I was wondering too, do videos work also? Well, the viewfinder would seem to work, but the minute we hit the button to start recording, it errors out. Capture failed, restarting your device might fix the problem. So you can't capture video on the PinePhone just yet, but hopefully in the future soon we will be able to. So with that said, that's some impressive progress on the part of the UB Ports team. And very soon, Ubuntu Touch will be a fantastic daily driver ready operating system for the Pine Phone. But with that said, that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.